Hi guys, welcome to my first ever video blog. I thought for this I'd try and recreate a lip look that I fell in love with recently. Um, I saw it actually on the Burberry catwalk for the first time. It's this gorgeous berry colour which looked great against all the different skin tones and I thought it'd be re a really great colour for autumn winter. Um, if you follow my blog regularly you'll have seen that top of my autumn winter beauty wish list was the actual lipstick that they used at Burberry for the show. So I thought what I'd try and do was recreate the look but at a cheaper price point. So I went into Boots recently and I picked up this gorgeous lipstick by Rimmel. It's part of the Lasting Finish Lipstick range um, in the colour Starry Eyed. As you can see, it's a really, really nice kind of berry colour. Um, has a really gorgeous shimmer to it. It's nice and creamy, um, really nourishing on the lips. So that's the lipstick I'll be using to try and recreate the look. Um, to act as a base for that, I picked up this lip liner from Natural Collection which again is a really similar colour, it's a nice um, nice berry sort of colour, nice and deep, which I think will go really great um, for this look. So to begin with, I've just prepped my lips with a lip balm. I've used this one by Evelon, it's called Kiss Mix. It's completely up to you what lip balm you use, um, it really doesn't matter, it's just anything that gives a great base. I personally love this one because it's really intense, really hydrating, um, really gives like a deep nourishing feel. My lips are actually tingling at the moment, so I can tell it's working, so that's why I love that one. Um, yeah, to begin with, I will basically take the lip liner, um, outline my lips and then fill them in to act as a base. So what I tend to do is just go around all of the outside of my lips and make sure the line is kind of equal to my lip line on the bottom um, and then just fill in. With my top lip what I would tend to do, especially for a lip look that's this um, intense and quite a deep colour, I would actually go a little bit above my natural lip just to make my lips look a bit fuller. Um, it's completely up to you, but I just prefer with a nice deep colour, you know, that they stand out a little bit more. So I will just take it slightly higher. I mean, obviously you still want a really natural looking lip, but um, it's just something to give it a bit of extra, really. So yeah, you just want to Fill those in nicely, um, as if you're actually wearing lipsticks, you want to create a really great base for your lipstick so that it doesn't, um, doesn't bleed and it kind of stays as long as possible. So yeah, that's that part done. Um, as you can see, it's actually kind of a bit of a pinky red kind of colour, which again, I think is going to be really great for this look because um, I kind of want to build layers to give it that really, really deep, intense kind of colour. So. I think the contrast in the pink and the kind of berry might be really nice. So next, all I will do, um, literally take my lipstick and apply it as it is. I know some people really like using a lip liner. Um, I personally don't. I just prefer to kind of whack it on as it is. Because um, I feel for me, it just gives a bit of a, a deeper kind of look, which is what I'm, I'm going for with this. So I will literally just over the lip liner. You can actually see there that there is a difference in colour. This does have a bit of a deeper kind of purpley colour compared to the pink of the lip liner. So like I said before, I think the contrast will create a really nice, um, a really nice deep intense look.
So yeah, just making sure you have every all of the bits uh, that you've filled in. What I would um, then do is just go back over with my lip liner, just kind of fill in any lines that might be a bit uneven. Um, the lipstick looks like it might be running slightly. Just want to even it all out. Yeah, so that's that's that stage. Um, sometimes what I do just to make sure that the skin around my lips is completely flawless, um, I just add a bit of concealer. Um, I love this one by Benefit. Uh, it's called Boing. It's industrial strength, which is exactly what I need. Um, basically, it's just great to kind of give it a really nice flawless base because you want your lips to be the main focus really here, especially with such a great colour. So yeah, just to fill in... any areas and then finally just take a tissue and just blot and there you go that's my um, Berber inspired lip I hope you all enjoyed um, please give me any feedback at all that you'd like as I said this is my first ever video so I really really would appreciate any comments um, if you want to take a look at my blog I'll put the link below, um, which will include details of all the products that I've used, um, as well as a few pictures of the look, so you can compare my look to the Burberry look. Um, and yeah, I hope you enjoyed. Thank you so much for watching. Bye!